representatives has denied a 150 million dollar bribery allegation against the house committee on financial crimes chairman and members chairman of the committee honorable ginger obinna who denied the allegation in a press conference at the national assembly complex on tuesday says the allegation was false stating that at no time did he or any member of the committee demand for money from the embattled company Recall that the committee on the 4th of March 2024 had invited Binance and its chief executive to appear before it to answer questions on allegations that bordered on multiple financial and economic crimes and irregularities by some civil society organizations, which were perpetrated by Binance against the Nigerian economy and the state, but failed to appear. It says the committee wishes to emphasize that all interactions with Binance were formal, open and transparent, as the committee never met with Binance team outside the National Assembly, nor did the committee delegate any individual or entity to meet with the Binance team on its behalf for any purpose contrary to the news report by a media outfit. The committee, however, says it will seek redress from a competent court of jurisdiction to prove its innocence and to ensure justice is done on the matter. Chang Pen Ho was sentenced to four months in prison, down from three years demanded by prosecutors for money laundering, unlicensed money transmitting, and violation of scattle in the United States. Richard Jones, the presiding judge at the sentence hearing, said, Zo put balance, growth, and profit over compliance with United States laws and regulations. I wouldn't talk very much about that. They would have their day in court. Uh, but I'd like to encourage the media. It is not enough uh, for anyone to come subsequently and apologize about misrepresenting facts uh, or you know, spreading disinformation. I think that you owe it a duty to Nigerians uh, to accurately report on this matter. If somebody is before the courts and is clutching for straws because they know that they are drowning, and then they come out to, to accuse the, a whole institution of government because they want to distract from what it is that they've done. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.